What's going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to Spectacle Island. We have a whole lot of stuff to get done today. We have got to get canola planted in all of island number one, the main primary island. We have canola in field 12 already. We need to get canola in field 13, in 15, in 11, in 14. We have grass in 16, so we're not going to worry about that right now. The first field that we have got to get done today is field number 15. Rocking up here. We have not been up here since, I think, since we started this uh, this Let's Play. I think it was the first couple episodes was the last time that we were actually in field 15. We got it cleared, and then we were done. We didn't have to come back in here. But we're in here today. So how is everybody doing? What are you guys up to today? It is a Saturday. It is a beautiful day here in the mountains of North Carolina. It's getting cold, though. It's getting very, very chilly. Uh, what's it like in the rest of the world, in the rest of the country, in uh, Canada, down in Mexico, uh, in Europe, UK? What's everybody up to, even down under? <laughs> the uh, the Aussies, how are you guys doing? What is up everywhere? Yeah, yeah. So, again, like I said, we are planting canola. Reason being is we are preparing for a huge harvest, a massive harvest. A harvest that is going to encompass the entire map. Well, with the exception of the top two islands, islands two and or three and four. So, why are we doing this? Well, we are preparing and getting everything ready. We want to get our money as high as possible. Uh, we got some more big stuff coming to Spectacle Island. It is going to be a spectacle for sure. A lot of good stuff happening, a lot of great things happening. Um, we also need to double check our corn, which is in G1. We need to make sure that it is good, that it is completely fertilized all the way to the top which i gotta tell you i don't know if it is let's double check that real quick no it is not fertilized so we need to make sure we get a fertilization state on that we're gonna try and get a sprayer we'll go around and see if we can find us a big sprayer that's going to be the best thing that we can do for that so that being said i think it's time for a little speedy let's do it guys We've got one worker going. I just hired them. We've got everything moving and grooving up there. It's going attached. Looks like we are good here. We've got it full and it's already set on canola, which is perfect. We are going to head over to the neighboring field. I believe it's 13. Yeah, field 13. We have not been on field 13. Again, a lot of these fields we've only done one time maybe twice what helper eye has not completed their task you stupid you did one run what are you doing get, get back over here get back on it again we are rocking with the green and orange right now uh, we will be swapping over to pink tractors uh, for the second half of the month uh, second half of october to on a breast cancer and and bring some awareness to that and again all super chats donated during live streams in the month of october go towards breast cancer awareness and they will be donated at the end of the month and i will be matching those dollars as well so if you guys uh, have five dollars and you're wanting to donate to a charitable cause trust me this is one that i stand behind and uh it's really 
come on, really? <laughs> it's really impacted uh, my life and my family as well, and uh, as well as a lot of the people around me. So uh, if it's something that you want to do, uh, I, I highly encourage you to do that. If it's not to me, then, then to someone else, some other cause. Definitely, definitely, definitely. So with that being said, let's get that done. Drop down, turn it on, and we are off again. Yes, we're going to try and get every single field done today. I don't know if we're going to be able to get it done or not. We don't have a lot to do though. Our biggest fields are completely done. And so that means really all we have are the two fields we're doing right now, 15 and 13. And then what, 11 and 14, I believe. That's it. Because 12 is growing. Yeah, no, I think that's just about it. And I can see him up there. Oh, let's see if we can boom out. See him a little bit at the top of the screen, just a little bit, not too much. I'm trying to get all of this field as much as possible. I, when I made this field, I kind of, I think I got overly ambitious with the exteriors of. <laughs> it's just a little too much, man. It's just a little too much. I gave it too much oomph. It's all right. Regardless. We've still got plenty to do, a lot to do. So how about this? Let's finish this field up and let's finish up field 15, which shouldn't take too long. I think this one's only gonna take one, one headland then we could probably slam a worker on this one, get it completely done. Again, a lot of work to do today, easy work, but a lot of work to do today. The faster we can get it done, the better. Well, except for Alien Jim, who, if I made an hour-long video, would be super happy. <laughs> At least I think he would be. Heck, I mean, you guys will see an hour-long video. Let me know down in the comments section. I'll be happy to do like a, you know, once a once a week kind of movie movie kind of thing, little little cinematic epicness. And in here, we have Phil Thirteen, the Wild Valtra S series. Pulling the Amazon 15 meter cedar. Meter and cedar rhyme. <laughs> Gosh, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, canola everywhere is about to happen. Let's do it, baby. Another field, another doneness. Let's see, let's raise this up. We have a little bit, yeah, just a little tuft right here. Nothing major, just a little something, something. Get it, got it, good. Turn it off, raise it up. We do have our other guy right here working hard. Why did it go that way? Now that doesn't make any sense. Hey, these workers, I swear they're all stuck. Stupid idiot. Right here. Do you see where you go? Yeah. Good job. Now, one thing I do want to check because this field, we did put stuff down in it that was kind of funky. Yeah. See all this right here? All these chunks? Those were, I believe, where we put down. Yeah. We're going to have to plow all that up. 
Oh boy. Let's see, let's hit that. Let's hit this. Drop it down. So, those of you that don't remember, I did put down a bunch of windmills to kind of, yep, that spot's not going to take it either. I put down a bunch of windmills so that we could get rid of a bunch of money. And because I did all that, it looks like the windmills have deleted the field state, which is quite interesting. So what we are going to have to do is we're going to have to go in and we're going to have to plow all that up. We're going to have to, I don't know if we're going to have to create field or what, but it's basically convinced itself that there's no field there. And I ran into this issue on South Mountain Creamery about two weeks ago. And we'll just have to do it again. So let's plop this cat in here somewhere. Let's just drop it off. And about right there. That's good. That will do. Now let's bump over. Where is... There we go. T-Series. This will work perfect. Let's get out of here. I don't think we can throw duels on here. If we could, that would be awesome. Let's take a look and see. I don't know if we can. I know we can't do all over duels, but wheel weights, narrows, rear twins. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah. Doesn't look stupid at all, does it? <laughs> yeah. I swear, there's some tractors that look great with rear twins, and there are some that just look stupid. <laughs> this is one of the latter. This is definitely one of the latter. But you know what? It's fine. Whatever. It's okay. Oh, gosh. And got it. Now, on two field, was it 14? Yeah, 14 is where we're having the issues. You guys are going to kind of help me with this a little bit. We're trying to deduce, again, did it just delete the field? Because it still shows that my field is there. It shows it's been planted. But on the screen, on the menu screen, it says that it has not. So does that mean that we have to plow this up again? I don't know. I'm not going to create field. I'm just going to go for it and see if this fixes my issue. It looks like this might be doing it. And of course, we're going to have to plant it again, but that's okay. You know, it's that I'm not concerned about. It's just the fact that I want the entire field, the whole thing, to be planted. This seems to be working. Is it showing up as plowed? That is a question. Let's take a look. Okay, it is showing that it is plowed. That is good. I think this fixes the issue. I don't know how much we're going to have to do. So I think what I'm going to do is just hit like right around here, maybe. About right there. Yeah, that looks good. And then back up through here. This should plow as well. Yep, and it is. And then maybe get it about right here and just hire a worker. Let it go up and down a few times. And then just wait until these little green dots disappear. Or say green dots, but... Okay, so we did need to come over a little bit further. That's alright. Yeah, you could... <laughs> they're all the same shape. That's exactly where we put those things. Alright, should end about right there. And it does. Let's fire the worker. Bring him back down. That way we just get a nice straight line. Keeps us from having... Well, keeps us from having to do it all ourselves, but keeps all the trouble out of it. And eventually it should recognize and be able to do it itself. There we go. Hire a worker. For those of you that say I never plow fields, what do you call this? Huh? What am I doing right now? Definitely, definitely plowing a field right now. <laughs> yeah, I'm kidding. I don't plow fields, no. No, plowing and cultivating, that's just an extra step that doesn't really need to happen. It just takes forever. And uh, farmers all over the world 
are trying to come up with ways where they can get away with not plowing their fields. Don't believe me? Look into it. Do a little bit of research. I promise that's the case. All right. There's that. Now we've got what I would consider to be a fairly straight line. Hire worker. We should be able to set this worker on and just kind of let him do the thing until it gets all the way over here. Well, not all the way over here, but you know what I mean. So, back at it, back to work we go. Yep, here he goes. He's booking it along though. I will say that, little booger is booking it along. So we got this field, we got one more field over there. And then as soon as we get these, we will be ready to start fertilizing the cornfield. Hopefully that won't take too long. Um, I've got an idea, but I think I'm gonna have to reinstall a mod to make it happen. It's a mod I've never used before, but I think it fits perfect with the green and orange. So we shall find out. So that is done. This seems to be going strong. I think I will hit a headland at the top and I'm gonna send him down just to kind of do a little preventative maintenance and get him to stop where I want him to stop. Or her, whoever it is in there. So they're gonna get down to the end right there. Perfect fire worker. And then we are going to drop that down and this won't take long to replant. It's annoying, but it will not take long to replant. I think about there is good. So what I'm gonna do is hire a worker and send them down. And then we're gonna send them back up to hit that center section. What should happen is they'll get to this part, realize that it's already been plowed, and then they just won't do it. And they'll stop, hopefully. That way I don't have to babysit. Now, last chance, last look. Did I get it down the main area? See, it's not showing plowed. Why is it not showing plowed? It's showing growing. I don't, I don't understand what's going on right now. I may have to create new fields and make this happen. Uh, hope not. Oh well, we'll see in a few minutes, I guess. Well, the plow is done and we've actually started over there already. We're gonna give it a try and see. Oh boy, this should have done it. Let's take a look in the map real quick, just to double check it. All the circles have gone. It is only plowed now. So this should, in theory, work. It appears that it is. I am gonna boom out a little bit further just to make sure, wrong way. <coughs> Goodness, I'm still dying. Look out. <coughs> uh, yeah, I believe that fixed our problem. So if that ever happens to you, you know what to do. So we're gonna reset a little bit. We're going to regroup and get a nice sprayer mod installed. We're gonna put it in the game. We're gonna go buy it. And we're gonna use it on the corn. This is, to my knowledge, one of the largest, if not the largest sprayers in the entire game, period. About to find out, I've never used it before. I've seen Big Daddy use it quite a few times and I'm excited. Let's do it. Well, it's here. We got the Amazon Pantera. Oh, yeah, yeah. Look at this thing. It is absolutely <laughs> massive. Why I have never used this, I will not know. Sounds good, looks good, is good. Interior's fantastic. This is incredible. Look at this thing, 32 miles per hour. Turns on a dime, sounds great. Let's go and fill it up. It'll hold 4,500 liters. I bought 4,000 
We'll see if that's enough for the field. I'm sure it'll be plenty. Um, we've also leased this. I have not purchased this. Uh, the amount of money that we are going to make off of it is going to be absolutely substantial. And I don't really... The, okay, so let's take a look at it. <laughs> Sprayers, here it is. The Amazon Pantera. $245,000. It's like half of my... This is more than half of my money. So I was like, well, not more than half. It's less than half, but it's around there. So I was like, I can either pay that or I can pay nineteen grand. And I won't even see a bit of it gone. So it's going to work at 7 miles per hour. It has a 41 meter working width. That is huge. And it has a trailer hitch on it. It does steer a little slow. Uh, let's turn on our help window here. So it looks like we can either bring in the wheels or push them out and it looks like that is the only thing that we can do with that i was hoping we'd be able to do some other stuff but looks like that is it it is kind of slow going understandable the horsepower is not the greatest actually what is the horsepower rating on this thing 218 so it's not immense by any stretch of the word but it's all right. It would be nice to not have it do all wheel steering because I feel like with the all wheel steering, it's just a little bit much. You have to kind of baby it or else it, well, does this, frankly. <laughs> so we do have to be careful. Hopefully the wheels do not have collisions on them or not collisions, but hopefully they're viewed as narrow wheels or else we are going to have a bit of a chore trying to clean up this corn so let's start booming it out god this thing is going to be just out there so there's the first here's the second the third <laughs> gosh the third boom and then finally the fourth boom out <laughs> oh my gosh I was about to say I don't even know if I can boom my camera out far enough here we go let's back it up a little bit back it up back it up back it up can we just hire a worker here hire a worker and they are going for it oh I have worker by seed and fertilizers turn that off there we go don't need to be doing that I think we'll be able to do just fine on this field so there she blows she's doing a good job going through here getting it all done for us this is good why is it always good why is it all? can't one day we just have something bad happen no 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 I take it back I take it back don't I don't want nothing bad to happen. Nothing bad to happen ever. No, 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 no. So we've got this. This is good. This is rocking and rolling for us. We do have a couple more things that we need to do around before we get done. Uh, I've got a bunch of silage. <laughs> a whole heap of silage. A couple things we could do with that. We can either sell it or we can store it. Personally, I would rather sell it. I think that's going to be better off for us in the long run. Just get rid of it. We don't need it. We're not using it for anything. So, I don't want to say let's babysit this thing. But I don't want to just leave him sitting either. Oh, goodness. Because if I know workers, this guy will say, Oh, well, he's not looking at me anymore. Let's go do something crazy. Let's, let's just drive off the side. <laughs> it would do it trust me so I'm gonna babysit this guy a little bit more and we're gonna see if anything happens to him if anything crazy happens if it does you'll know about it trust me so cornfield let's finish it up it's not gonna take a huge amount of time but it is gonna take us a few minutes so let's get it done Thank you. 
And I believe that is it right there. Perfect. Where are we? Here we are. <laughs> hey, let's fold it up. I did realize that our cornfield on field 8, 9, 10, and 1 not been it's it's not been fertilized yet either which stinks so we are going to have to get over there and fertilize that as well that is going to take a little bit more time than this it's also going to take a lot more energy because we can't just do it so we are going to take this back uh first things first let's check let's go over here and check and see how much silage we actually have put that about right there and let's hop out how much silage do we have in here 804 thousand liters okay so that seems like that is going to be a sale so I don't think we are going to mess around with that so with that being said I think that is going to be it for today I appreciate you guys hanging out with us for a little while Check us out tomorrow. We will be taking care of that silage and we will be taking care of the corn as well. Getting everything back ready to go. I'm very excited about it. So guys, I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you're not already, please subscribe. If you guys want to see more like this, let me know down in the comments section. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. With that being said, I hope you have a great day and we will see you later. Peace.